Hi everyone, it's Hector at the Herald Review. I am at Rumlime Vineyards and Lavender Farm in Wilcox. In about 10 days, they're going to host their third annual Lavender Festival. I'm doing a preview for the Herald Review, so check it out on Sunday. And let's take a look at uh, what the potential is for this year's festival. Uh oh. You're 10 days out. You ready? No. <laughs> Well, so this year you have some new things happening. You Obviously, you've opened the cafe, and that's going to give you all of this shaded area plus area for people to mingle. So tell me about uh, having that uh, at a responsibility of the cafe and the festival running at the same time. Well, we're definitely new to it. We really have no idea what to expect. We're trying to incorporate this, which is new to us to begin with, with a brand, we're going to have a pared down menu that day and trying to get a nice flow down so people can come in, get their food, find a lovely place to sit, enjoy the festival, enjoy all the vendors. And uh, are you going to do a little breakfast open at 8 a.m.? Yep, we and, are. And so that's, uh, so that's probably a recommendation for people to get here. Early. Uh, as early as they can. And we'll be doing the same thing we did last year. We'll have the lavender distillation demonstration. It's always yeah. so hard to say. Yeah, yeah. And then we'll do some some small tours. I think we have, if, if on the Events Bright website, uh, we posted a, um, a schedule of when that would be. I think the first lavender distillation is going to be at 8.30. We are making cakes and cookies and baking like crazy. I'm making soap. I just got back from the grocery store to buying distilled water. I ran out. And yeah, we're just trying to get everything so that we have enough to keep everybody happy. Uh, last year you had a little bit of music. Uh, you're going to yes. have the same. The same show. gentleman will be here oh, playing. Oh, fantastic. Yeah, yeah. That was great. Great yeah. sets. And it, you know, he really kept the music going all day, really. He did. He did. In, uh, so let me see, what else do you have? Anything new uh, happening uh, as far as vendors? Uh, People we have up. two miniature donkeys that are going to be here from the Benson Donkey Rescue. Okay. I'm very excited about that. 